Welcome to New Possibilities. I speak truth to power without fear. So I'm at the airport in a public space, so I had to make this video real quick. I just wanted to briefly talk about Kendrick Lamar. He had a concert recently in Alabama or some southern state, and he invited a white fan onto the stage, and they were singing Mad City, from what I understand. And that song has the N-word throughout the song. And so when the white fan started to use the N-word, you know, singing the song, he basically cut off the music and called her out. And some people are saying he threw the fan under the bus. So I want to share my thoughts about this. You know, first of all, it's never acceptable for a white person to use the N-word, period. You know, so that's off the top. So I can understand why he would call her out for using the N-word. So that's the first point. The second point is this, and it deals with the hypocrisy of artists like uh, Kendrick Lamar. How are you gonna get mad at somebody for using the N-word when you use it all the time? You know, so I don't, th I think that's fake outrage when you are constantly putting out music, constantly using the N-word, you know, constantly putting this music out here for the whole world to consume, not for just the black community to consume, but for the whole world to consume. You got a lot of white fans that listen to your music, you know, so you shouldn't be surprised that they're using the N-word because you're basically making it acceptable for people to use the N-word. And I really think that it has to get, we have to get to a point where that using the N-word, period, is not acceptable. Now, I obviously understand that there's a difference when black people use it and when white people use it. You know, it has a different type of meaning. But the fact of the matter is, it has the same origin. No matter how you try to switch it up, that word is rooted in slavery. That word is rooted in the oppression and humiliation of black people. And no black people should be using that word. And it's just a shame that you have these popular artists who are known worldwide perpetuating that negative word, giving that negative word new life, giving that word power that it shouldn't have. So, that's what I have to say about that, man. It's just something else for somebody to pretend like they're all outraged when, you know, their music is the part of the reason why that word is so popular and so commonplace nowadays. But anyway, tell me what y'all think. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Peace.